electrifying debuts, eye-catching exteriors, futuristic interior. Those are a few of the significant stories this week as Under the Pentastar goes to the North American International Auto Show. Chrysler put a spark in the Detroit show by broadening its electric drive lineup to five vehicles. Frank Cleegan, senior vice president of product development, took the wraps off the all-electric Dodge Circuit EV, which has an all-new front and rear design and a stunning new interior. So the Dodge Circuit EV puts up some pretty impressive numbers, like 0 to 60 in less than 5 seconds, a quarter mile in 13 seconds, a top speed of 125 miles per hour. But i got to tell you, the most impressive number is zero, as in zero gasoline consumption and zero tailpipe emissions. Plug the Dodge Circuit prototype into any household outlet, and it's ready to zip with a range of 150 to 200 miles. And for those who want something more rugged, there's the Jeep Patriot EV. This range-extended Jeep prototype can travel up to 40 miles of all-electric operation with zero fuel consumption and zero emissions. For longer trips, it has a range of up to 400 miles using its small gasoline engine. The Patriot EV features our Envy range extended electric system that dramatically reduces the carbon footprint of the world's most capable compact SUV. The refined, clean front appearance matches the refined and clean powertrain. Chrysler Vice Chairman and President Jim Press saved one surprise for the show, the Chrysler 200C EV, the sports sedan of the future. Featuring the range extended electric drive powertrain, the 200C shows that a green driving machine can also be beautiful. The sophisticated, fresh and appealing design of this concept vehicle represents a coming out party for what the new Chrysler is going to be. Our engineering heritage, it's part of our DNA. And as we apply it to the future products, it will truly set us apart. Inside the 200C, the touchscreen instrument panel connects the driver to the outside world, allowing a new, exciting level of connectivity. Those three electric drive vehicles join the Chrysler Town & Country EV and the Jeep Wrangler Unlimited EV in the Chrysler lineup. One of them will be on the streets very soon. Chrysler will have 100 NV electric drive vehicles in fleet service this year and the first electric vehicle for retail consumers by 2010. By 2013, Chrysler plans to have three additional electric drive models in production. I think a lot of people came to this show thinking it was going to be a little bit of a yawn and they weren't expecting much from us. I think we uh, certainly continue to substantiate our strong commitment and presence on range extended electric vehicles with the new Jeep Patriot. And then I think it was a jaw dropping experience when uh, we revealed the Chrysler 200 four door sedan. For customers in the market for a current Chrysler, Jeep or Dodge, the deals just got hotter. The Treasury Department announced Friday that it will make a $1.5 billion loan to Chrysler Financial, giving customers access to affordable vehicle financing. Well, you know, one of the biggest issues we face is restricted credit. Uh, customers are coming into the showrooms, they find cars they love, they want to buy them, uh, but they can't because credit has not been available. We've been the only company that didn't have access to a captive finance company up until today. And boy, am I happy to say we're back in business and we now have $1.5 billion to lend to buy Chrysler, Jeep, and Dodge cars and trucks. And finally, the Dodge Ram was named the International Truck of the Year, beating the Ford F-150 and the Subaru Forester for top honors. The Ram earned the award from the International Car of the Year jurors, a nationally renowned board of automotive editors and journalists from a variety of respected publications and broadcast outlets. And those are a few of the significant stories this week under the Pentastar. I'm Betty Carrier Newman.